We now know rumors of a possible KKK rally in Durham Friday started with information shared by the sheriff's office. Those rumors sparked a large march Friday in downtown. Throughout the day, the sheriff's office urged people not to spread rumors. But attorney Scott Holmes, who represents the eight people charged in the toppling of a Confederate monument, tweeted about the possibility, later saying he got that information from a major in the sheriff's office. So we reached out to Sheriff Mike Andrews for a response. He released a statement saying his agency was still working Friday to verify the Klan was coming, but had a duty and obligation to notify community leaders about that potential. He says that information was not meant for the leaders to, quote, independently sound the alarm ahead of law enforcement, potentially triggering needless panic and anxiety. Here's what Holmes told us tonight by phone. It's a really difficult situation for the sheriff handling this kind of situation and trying to predict the unpredictable and it was complicated and a potentially volatile situation and so i appreciate how he handled it sheriff andrews says quote had my office never said a word and the clan never arrived it would have been a normal friday in the bull city had it never given key leaders advanced warning and the clan arrived my agency would have been criticized for being silent with prior knowledge albeit unverified you can read the sheriff's entire statement and Holmes' reaction on WNCN.com.